to speak with both of Nevada's senators about the health care debate in their D.C. offices. That's right. Ariana Bennett is live on Capitol Hill for us tonight. And Ari, I imagine they're pretty busy, huh? Yeah, they absolutely are. Dean Heller especially is in really high demand because he's one of the few Republicans who's voted no on all of the Obamacare repeal bills so far. We were actually in his office earlier today. The phones were ringing off the hook, mostly constituents calling to weigh in on the health care issue. And he says he wants them to know he's listening. I know that I am standing between perhaps this White House, perhaps even this legislature and the state of Nevada to do what's best for him. When asked if Dean Heller is feeling the heat right now as one of the only Republican holdouts in the Obamacare repeal, he says he welcomes the debate. I voted to have this debate because they're not all bad ideas. Heller wants to be clear. He is in favor of repealing most of the Affordable Care Act, eliminating the individual mandate and its penalties, even though that likely means fewer people with health insurance. Do you believe that it's better if more people are insured? Absolutely. Absolutely. I, I do want that, but I want individuals to have a choice. Right now, they, the ACA doesn't even give you a choice. Heller wants to keep Medicaid funding out of the repeal, along with protection for those with pre-existing conditions and those who want to stay on their parents' insurance plan until age 26. So far, he hasn't seen a plan he's liked enough to vote for it, but his vote is still winnable. If it's better for the state of Nevada, absolutely. Yeah, we're taking a look, and there's some good ideas out there. On his good ideas list is opening up the insurance market across state lines, increasing competition, which he says will drive down costs. On his bad ideas list is rebranding Medicaid cuts as just slowing the rate of growth, as some top officials have called it. And they said, hey, we have a new way of looking at Medicaid. I asked them, is there $772 billion in cuts over the next 10 years? Because if that's still in there, I'm not going to support it. On the other side of the aisle, Senator Catherine Cortez Masto doesn't have any ifs about her position. It's happening uh, now, and um, uh, we are going to do everything we can to fight against it. Like the rest of her party, Cortez Masto says it's small adjustments we need, not a total overhaul. To me, that starts with keeping the Affordable Care Act as a foundation and improving upon it because there are major fixes that we have to address. On her list is bringing down premiums and bringing insurance carriers back to states like Nevada after they pulled out of rural counties among all the uncertainty in the market. Both of our senators agree it's a major issue that needs close attention. In fact, they both disagree with the forced manner in which the issue landed on the Senate floor without committee hearings, expert testimony, or enough discussion. And that's the tragedy of this. You know, this is this is not why I came to the United States Senate. You know, we, we, this is a, such an important issue, as you well know, for millions of Americans. Bad process produces bad legislation. And if we can get it through the committee, uh, let the discussions happen, keep it in the open, bring experts in, have these discussions, we'd be producing a lot better legislation um, at the end of the day. Now, Heller wouldn't give me a straight answer about whether he'll support the so-called skinny repeal bill or any of the other bills that they eventually come up with. He says he just needs to take a look at it and then he will decide. Now, I did speak with both senators about a variety of other issues and things they're working on. I will bring you that story coming up tomorrow night. And until then, covering the story live from Capitol Hill, Ariana Bennett, Channel 2 News. All right, Ari, thanks so much. We'll check in with you once again tonight on Channel 2 News at 630. All right, let's get to